What's good, YouTube? It's been a while. I know. Um, I haven't filmed a video in a in a while, just simply because I didn't feel like it. <clears throat> but I still have been going to the gym. Um, the bulk has officially come to an end. Um, I PR'd yesterday, and I didn't get it. Um, that sucks because I feel like I really uh, pushed myself. I when I started the bulk, I was 175. When I ended, I was 192. So I thought thought I would get a little bit of, of progress, but I didn't. My max, I PR'd on. I tried to PR on bench, and it stayed exactly the same. Um, it stayed at 185, which is unfortunate. Uh, but I think I know some of the things I did wrong. Um, one, I really did. Uh, I really did neglect counting. Um, I didn't count calories. I didn't count macros. I was just like, just eat a lot and you'll gain weight. And I did gain weight. Um, so I thought, oh, that works. It doesn't. Counting is counting is important. Um, two, I didn't flat bench at all since I maxed out last year. And it's mainly because I just don't like to flat bench. It feels awkward and not really good on, on my on my shoulders. Um, I like incline benching a lot better with a barbell. Um, the elbow path uh, for me it just feels better. And I mean nobody really has a built up upper chest, so I just prefer to do incline. So I mean and I didn't really I didn't even do f uh, flat bench variations either. I didn't do flat dumbbell. I didn't do Smith machine. Um, did do any of that. My chest days strictly consisted of incline pressing uh, and cable flies or the pec deck m machine um, and the chest press machine as well. I never did flat bench anything. So I guess logically speaking, if you want to use common sense, if you want to improve on a lift, you have to actually do it. So I might just need to... Um, might just need to deal with it. If I do f flat bench movements, I'm probably going to do dumbbells just because you can kind of turn your wrist to a more neutral position and you can also control your elbow path a bit better. But um, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully y'all didn't hear that text notification. Also did not take into consideration how um, loud the background noises are. I'm sorry, I can't do anything about that. They have to stay on. I don't really know what it is. I think that's like a dehumidifier or something. <clears throat> um, but yeah, uh, we're starting off with bicep curls. Now I believe in the first arm day I did, I explained how my left arm is <clears throat> uh, weaker than my right arm. So we're going to be doing until failure with the left arm just normal curls, but we're going to count how many reps, and then we're going to do the same amount of reps with my right arm, even if my right arm can do more reps. My The dumbbells I have here at home, they jump up by 10 pounds, which I kind of regret doing. Um, it was my brothers and I chose it. It's, it goes 20, 30, 40, and 50, so um, there's no 25s. I like to curl up the 25s. Um, if this feels too easy, then we'll go up to 30, but for now, we're going to start with 20. Let's just uh, let's throw it around. That light is annoying. I block it with my dome head. Nope. All right. Seventeen. Whew, good grief. So 
between 17 with the right arm. I probably could have gone to at least 20 with the right arm, but my left arm could only do 17. <clears throat> so we only do 17 with the right arm. Um, while we rest, ooh, do you guys, write in the comments, do you guys have any New Year's resolutions? Or do you even do those? I don't. <laughs> Just because, you know, when I was little, of course, I would make them. And a lot of New Year's resolutions would always be to lose weight, be more active, be outside more. I just, I stopped focusing on them because I was just like, one, I'm just not going to do them. I'm going to be like everyone else and like be good about it the first two weeks and then just give up. Um, but I kind of figured that like at some point during the year I would change something up if I felt it was necessary, right? So if I had to pick a New Year's resolution, for me it would be to go outside more because I just, I don't do that. Um, I'm, I'm super pasty. I sunburn easily. I just like being indoors more. Um, but my brothers and my buddy Tanner, as you guys know from LAT Outdoors, they're outside all the time. My brothers still burn e easily, but they're outside all the time. Of course, f fishing, trapping, doing what they do. I'm going to try to be with them more during the summer and, and, and fish more for sure. That's going to be like a goal of mine, but I'm not going to say it's like a New Year's resolution type thing. Um, And then, of course, when the bulk comes, bulk correctly. If I if I was doing New Year's resolutions, that would definitely be the other one. But I mean, other than that, I just I don't really focus on that. But if you guys have New Year's resolutions, write them down in the comments. Oh, good grief! Okay, second set. You guys cannot tell me that bicep pumps don't hurt like a mother. They're not as bad as, as leg pumps, but like if, if I had to rate pumps on a scale just based on pain, it would be um, it would be legs, biceps, shoulders, triceps, back and then chest. That would that would be how I, I I rank it. Chest and back day is the best day. Like if you think if you like to train legs, respect. But you need to be put on on a watch list. Cause I mean, <laughs> it's not fun. I hate it. I hate it. All right, second set. Here we go. Okay, we got 19. Two more than last time. Whoo! Okay, here we go, here we go. Third set. You guys ever think that uh, the first person who ever heard like a parrot talk back to them thought they were losing their mind? <laughs> like, can you imagine? Like you like just, like English is brand new, right? And you're like in the jungle or wherever the hell. I think my house is falling apart. I don't know. But um you're in the jungle or wherever parrots are and you say something like 
I don't know, you're like, rock. <laughs> and then you hear a parrot like above you going, rock. <laughs> like, like, would you not think that you were going insane or that you were in like some like freaking twilight zone or some shit? Like, that would be wild. Like, I can't imagine. That would be funny as hell. Um, the things I think about when I'm not awake. <clears throat> All right. Last set before we move on to triceps. Seventeen again. Woo. My father is home. That's why all the, all the stomping and my dogs are all excited. So you can probably hear like tip taps, their paws on the wood floor. Yeah. So, triceps. I hardly ever use, if at all, use dumbbells for triceps. I like cables, uh, Z bars, and even like the Smith machine. Right. So. I'm really kind of limited to like one, maybe two movements. Um, and it's not dumbbell kickbacks because that's gotta be the worst lift of, of all time. I just, you know, <clears throat> when I, my first year, the one movement I did with the dumbbell for triceps a lot was um, the overhead press or extension, whatever you want to call it. I like that one a lot. The only thing with that one is, at least for me, it's hard for me to keep my elbows in, which is kind of what you're supposed to do with that. Um, but since I'm limited with the amount of equipment I can use, I'm just gonna have to make do with what I got. So, Ugh. got a little 40, little 40 action here. Uh, let's just see what happens. I don't know. Um, I'll face you guys. Why not? What? Keep your elbows in as much as possible and you just push up. That feels heavy and not good on my shoulder for some reason. Up. Uh, might have to go light. Up. 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 Okay. That felt weird on my shoulder. Um, I, d I feel the stretch when I when I go down, but when I w when I press up, like something don't feel right. I don't know what it is, but um, we're gonna drop the weight um, and just try to make it burn as much as possible. With I guess the 30s we'll have to do. So yeah, man, that sound pump is loud. All right, we're gonna roll with the 30s. Hopefully the pressure on my shoulder don't feel too bad um again anything with pretty much anything other than dumbbells i use for triceps but again no equipment so we're rolling we're rolling with what we got so our second set of three hopefully you guys can see <laughs>
Okay, that felt better. Um, first, I was kind of working on just like explosiveness, and then I really wanted to feel the stretch at the bottom and just going slow because I realized it was a much lighter weight. It's a whole 10 pound decrease. So, um, I don't know if you guys ever do that. You like focus on your your uh, control like mid set, and you're like, wait, no, I need to go like slower and more control because this is a lighter weight. Or, and then you're like, oh no, I want to be more explosive, and then you. I need to decide what I want to do before I do that, before I do the lift. But on last set, we're gonna definitely go slow and control and make make sure it burns. Another question that I have not asked yet. I'm surprised I haven't. Music. When you're at the gym, what do you guys listen to? I have to know. So like, I don't have like like a main like artist, but like I would say like my genre of music is like really like like angry aggressive rap it just kind of gets me going <clears throat> but i think the one song that i've just been it just like gets me going like, i feel like i can deadlift a building when this song plays it's um orchard from kill station and g below hopefully i said that name right the beat drop that's like a minute and a half in like it's otherworldly but what do you guys li listen to when you're when you're lifting weights? Let me know. I keep losing my dumbbell. Hold on. Where I left it. What are we doing? Okay. Last set, and then we'll probably do. Probably do hammer curls, most likely. Yeah, hammer curl time. All right, it is hammer time, baby. I'm gonna switch up the angle a little bit. We're gonna do three sets of hammer curls. And then, I honestly don't know what I'm gonna do for triceps. Um, we'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out, but for now. Come here. Okay. It's hammer time. Probably gonna go eight reps, ten reps. We'll see. We'll see. Good set, good set. Well, while I rest, I do have a little, I had a little bit of an idea that, um, that I did not tell my brothers about, but if you guys are interested, um, we can totally do like challenges. I can do challenges with my brothers. Um, Tanner doesn't really go to the gym that often, so it would uh, pretty much be me or Ethan, me or Logan, or all, all, all three of us, maybe. Um, we can do like some weightlifting challenges. Loser does some punishment. Um, totally down to do that. Sounds like a lot of fun. So, uh, but let me know in the comments if you guys want to see that and what you want uh, the challenges to be, what you want the pun the the punishments to be. All right, second set. Here we go. Here we go. Hmm. Second set. Probably the same the same amount of reps. Probably good enough to. Get close, if not at failure, is a eight to ten with thirties. It's a pretty good rep range for me. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, come on. 
<sighs> Jeez. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, frick me. <sighs> sake okay I'm gonna try to figure out what to do for <clears throat> excuse me what to do for uh what to do for triceps so I'll let you guys know <clears throat> so I went to the good old Google and I saw a few most uh, a few sorry tricep workouts that you can do with dumbbells most didn't look all all that appealing but I saw one I saw one that I've seen people do before, so I'm going to try it. I've never done it before. Feel free to correct my awful technique and form, but um, you take a dumbbell, you put it behind your head, and you just stretch outward like, like that, like you're taking a sword out of its holster on your back, like a badass anime character. It's essentially what it is. You do it for both arms, so I'm just, I'm going to feel it out, see how it feels. Like the noises I'm making. That feels so weird. I can feel the stretch. Oh my goodness gracious. Feels weird in my shoulder too. I don't know. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Feels really strange. I hope I didn't just break my bench. <clears throat> feels very strange. My shoulder feels loose. I've never done it, so I mean, and the lightest dumbbell I have is 20, so it's uh, it's not gonna look pretty, but I do I do feel the the stretch when I'm locked back here and when I extend, so it feels good. It just may not be something I do ever again. <laughs> Alrighty. Here we go again. That feels janky. Here we go. Well, the For You page just been flooded recently with Kung Fu Panda. Mine has the the first one. Just been nothing but Kung, uh, but Kung Fu Panda. I forgot how goaded that, that movie was. I hope my bench is not broken. <clears throat> but uh, apparently there's a, f a fourth. Yeah, I think there's like a new fourth one coming out. I haven't seen the trailer. I just heard uh, some rumors, but um. All three of them are pretty solid, but like for me, the first one, I mean, you just can't. It don't get better than that. <clears throat> it really doesn't. 
go to movie. Last workout, bicep, probably gonna do some type of pre trick curl, I think is what we're gonna do, and then probably gonna call it right after that, so. So I only have a flat bench. Don't have an incline, so what we're gonna do is a pre trick curl. Elbow here, down, elbow probably at, at the edge, down here, pull up three sets of whatever and we'll call it an arm day. Okay. There we go. Single arm preach preacher curls is what I is what I should say. Here we go. Definitely gonna up the weight next set, but for now we're just gonna go slow to control, feel the burn. There we go. Gonna hit my face with this thing, bro. Definitely upping the weight the next set. Go another 30. Already got 30. This already feels heavy as hell, but we're gonna roll with it. Should be able to do at least, hopefully, eight. I hope so. Oh yeah, it's much better. Hurts really bad. Pumps crazy. Come on, come on. Oh, my arm's not forward enough. Come on, that counts the one. Why am I forgetting to start with, with my left arm? Oh my god, okay. Fuck. Alright. 
last set before I can go eat, because my oh my, am I starving. I'm going to start with my left arm because I forgot to do that in the last two sets. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh my goodness. Woo. It feels like I'm gonna tear my bicep. Like it doesn't hurt, but I can like, when I go down with my left arm, like I can, ugh, okay. Probably don't wanna play with that. So I did, that was six. So I have to do six with, with my right arm. My God. It didn't hurt, but it did not feel like something I should push if you if you know what I mean. Okay. Oh, that was seven. That, um, that concludes arm day, the first gym video of 2024. Um, again, uh, wherever you are in your gym journey, um, stay on the grind. Don't give up. I am someone that right now I am about two years exactly into my journey. I've learned a lot, but I still obviously have a lot to learn. Um, considering that I did a new workout <laughs> that I've never done before and I bulked but did not hit my I did not get a new PR so I still have a lot to learn we're all in this together um, please like the video if you, if you enjoyed it leave a comment um, yeah I will see you guys for probably well, I don't, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens. There probably won't be ar arms again because this is arms, so it'll, it'll, it'll either be chest and back or legs. So, yeah, I will see you guys later.